Where in the world is the third panel? Like, that's the first two. And they're both dead ends, right? But somewhere around here, there's got to be a third one so I can finish it, because there's three chunks in the bridge. I'm going to go up and input these two. And then we'll see if maybe that gives me access to a third one? What's this? That's just the book to take me back. Okay, there we go. And then the third one! Ta-da! There's nothing to do up here, is there? Yeah, having two of them solved does not appear to give me access to, like, a new puzzle-solving chamber or anything. That doesn't seem to matter. The next guess was that... Like, there's gotta- is there something down here that does something? Cause like, this is the mossy area, and there's the watery area. Those are like the two... This is like the region where I feel like I haven't done anything yet. Can I really- it looks so perfect, man. There's a lantern there, and it looks like a staircase. Is that really not where I go? The geography of these- oh, gate. Secret gate. There we go. You and your disorienting-ass geography. Okay, oh. The memories flood over me too fast. They race around inside my head, filling my soul with despair. And the more I think about how nothing can be done, how no one can be alive outside his shield, the faster the fog rushes in. I can lose myself in the fog. When it's thick enough, I can let, n I can let go and be safe. I can start to forget. But I must not forget. I must remember every lie they told my people. How they manipulated us all to get what they wanted. They told me they had to come fix my world. They had come to fix my world. They asked me to arrange a meeting with the elders. The books they carried in with them showed other worlds, beautiful places where people didn't have to work so hard to survive. They told my people that Atrus had written these books, that he had written Narian, but that he'd made our world unstable. They said he wanted to make us slaves to the tree. They asked me, Don't you remember, Savidro? Our father wrote this world to teach us, to show his sons what an age shouldn't be. I don't know what to say. I don't know how it could be true. But why would they lie? Why would Atrus have lied? The worlds they showed us in those books. The elders refused to believe them. They say we cannot... Abandon the tree. For thousands of years, we have tended the lattice roots. Without our traditions, we will die. I don't want us to die. I don't. But Cirrus and Akinar said that they would come back. Savidro. They said they would come back, Savidro. Just like Atris once said to you as well. He said he would come back, but then he didn't. He didn't, and for that, you will you will have to make him pay. It throws me off when I'm reading it, but it actually makes sense in concept. There, like, there's there's a this paragraph just ends with but Cirrus and Akinar said, and then just cuts off. There's no dot 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 or hyphen or punctuation. It just stops, and a new paragraph starts. But that's because they're actually notes of somebody that has this dis disjointed thought process, and they're writing it for themselves, not necessarily for anybody else. So, like, they're not, they don't necessarily need to end paragraphs correctly. The paragraphs will just end midstream if, if necessary. So, 
So I'm surrounded by mossy columns like I thought I'd be. I figured that this has to be re uh, roughly where the next one is. What in the world are you, by the way? A rotary phone? Oh, right. Always lover. Another upward view, but another view where we can't see the, that writing there. I think we're going to end up in a position where not only... Like, we're probably going to go over there, but also I think these things might rotate to show us the solution. Because the, uh, the other one was a series of floating rocks that we couldn't see until that position. And so, it might happen again. It appears that the water cup stuff might not serve a purpose. It's just there to look cool. Which, you know, that's fine. What the hell? These go in the holes. They're a little hard to click on correctly, but they're there. Okay. And what do you do? Excuse me? What? In the world? So is that one always in? That's probably Savidro's, uh... It's probably Savidro's, uh, what do you call it? Sabotage, right? Because I've, I've encountered previous puzzles where something was weirdly busted and broken in the other world. So he probably forced that one in to make it harder or something. So I... I assume what I'm supposed to do is fill these three slots with balls or something? There's like buckets in some of them and other ones are holes. It's hard to make out what this looks like. So it comes down this rail... And then lands... How do you tell where it's gonna land? These don't even look like they're helpful. These look like they're a ceiling or something. Let's look at it again. Okay. Did I put this one here? What? <laughs> what? Okay, um... Okay. It seems to throw it in the air when it gets to that or something. But then it crashed. It lands like right there, right? Which is the blank one. And it shot... When did it shoot? Let's try this again. I'll try to watch for what happens now that I have an idea what to look for. Okay. The rotary part seems true. I was watching this one this time. So I put it here. When this looped around to the bottom is when it sh is when it fired, apparently. So for some reason, this reaching the bottom makes this one fire. Huh. Let's try a different position to see how that changes the, the results. There you go. So it would appear that it needs to be 
So, so the, that seems to be the first correct answer, is the top middle. Because that makes it shoot across when it's under this loop thing, which makes it land there. Which means I want you to be the next one, don't I? Can you please grab them? That's the correct spot? Is it always the middle? Alright, let's see this. Was that good or bad? I guess that was bad because nothing happened. It shot across, then landed in the water. Isn't that... I mean, what else is going to happen? Let's go back down, see if it's down there, or is it just gone? For good? You can't see crap from down here, that's not- this is not useful. Uh, where do I want it to go? Well, there's the second layer, right? So I probably want it to fire when it's here. Because then it goes under this weird under loop, and then it would end up here. Because that was a hole, but this wouldn't be a hole then, because alternating ones aren't holes. Then I want it to be... I want it to be when this loops around, so it has to be the one that's after it. There we go. I could probably figure out where the next problem is going to be, but I might as well- I think I just want to watch it. There we go. Is the goal simply to keep it rotating for three cycles so that it doesn't... Am I literally just supposed to make it last long enough that it doesn't break or something? Am I supposed to send it back? Like, my issue here is I'm figuring out how to make it not break for longer, but I don't necessarily know where I'm trying to make it go, is the problem. So, when it loops around like this, it will... It'll get thrown. Shit. I wasn't paying enough attention to a specific detail here. I need to pay attention to the rotation of the left one so I know the position there. It's gonna be in... Okay, so it, it lands in the slot that's, I suppose, sabotaged. Okay, so when this rotates this way, then that rotates that way. I believe I want you there. Because then, it'll send it back when it reaches here, instead of going all the way to the position where it just ends. Yeah, because it stopped... I think I'm I think I'm right, I don't know. It's hard to articulate what's going on here a little bit. Nope, I still lose. That's all the moves I have, so that's it. That's the end. So then the question is... What does it want from me? Where am I trying to send the ball? It comes from that ball, doesn't it? No, maybe not. I can't see! <laughs> ah! I want I, I, There's no fixing it, because it's this is how the game works, but I really wish this was like real mist where I could just look around. Because I this camera angle is so... I can't even lear, like lean forward to get a better view. I think I just saw what I'm wrong about, though. 
I think what's going on is that this rail leaves my line of sight completely, and I can kind of see a hint of it down there, and then somewhere off camera, it then manages to get into here. And that's why it seems like the ball mysteriously appears without me being able to see it. I think this is the exit, actually, because it goes into, yeah, it goes into the building. But it'd be, it would be so much easier to see this stuff if I could just look around a little bit to get some 3D reasoning a little bit. But that's, that's what the game is. Okay. So you're the first step. You're probably still the second step. Then the final thing is going to be that I need to have this set up in a way that it'll fire when it's right here. Yeah, it has to fire when it's right here. So that it can then fall into that rail, because that's where the hole is. We've established it falls through the holes into the water, but instead of water, there's a rail here. And that's the exit. Ah. <sighs> I'm trying to get the rotation straight in my head. What is the rotational sequence? So I was putting it here, wasn't I? Shit, I'm just gonna watch it again. Does it always rotate the same direction? There. That blue, okay. I see it now. It has to be in this blue spot. I screwed up bad, didn't I? Okay. It fired on the wrong one, didn't it? I didn't realize something was wrong at first until I saw, until I saw what was happening in the second part, so I'm gonna double check real quick. No, that's correct. You're wrong. Wait, was I putting it in the wrong spot? It's you. I th oh, I think I got my wires crossed for a second there. Was I putting it there instead of there? I thought I'd made a mistake on the left side. And that I was making it, and I was breaking the sequence at the beginning. But I think I just flat out forgot what I was doing on the right. This game gives you the strangest additional confirmation that you've succeeded at a puzzle because you can see the entire screen transition to an, into a different st state of being pre-rendered or not, <laughs> which is funny. Okay, so... Now I'm gonna film the bottom quadrant of my crappy diagram. They're not, also not quadrants, they're... Tridrants? I don't know what to call that. A triple version of a quadrant. So we have a diamond floating in the middle. We have one, and then we have the three outer things. Interesting. A side effect of drawing it this way is I've realized that those three on the bottom of this one are filled in on all three diagrams. So as a result, because I'm dividing them into thirds and filling them in by thirds, it's actually completely filled in on those on these three squares. Uh, this one, this one, and this one. Because they're in all of them. So I think we just beat this age, right? I just got... Open up. I just got all three codes. So this is probably all we need in order to gain access to... Uh, 
whatever the symbol is for this time around. Despite the complicated diagram I did for drawing this stuff and, and being all set up to record this information, I think I have it memorized, actually. So, like, despite the drawing, I don't think I actually need to refer to it. Maybe drawing it out helped me memorize it, though. Um... Oh boy, I don't think we're done here. This looks complicated inside. Oh. I mean, the complications inside not, might not matter. This might just be the inner workings of the machine that we've been using. And that I might not need to do anything with it. Maybe. There's the chair. What a trippy room. I would not feel safe in this thing, by the way. There's no guard anything, and you're floating over this huge nightmare machinery. Twenty years, Atris. Twenty long years alone. They tied me to a post. They burn their missed blinking books in front of me. They took everything I had. My wife! My two baby girls! And then, when I finally made it back to Narayan and I saw... I saw... It would have been better if I had died. Wow. Atrus, you really birthed two little Satans, didn't you? Like, what the hell? And doesn't Catherine have another child right now? Should I be worried about the fact that they seem to have another child? Because they should stop having children. They have... They have they're not good at it. What the heck is that? It's cool seeing it all from up here. Like there's the there's the more raw rock area, there's the water area, there's the mossy area. What in the world? Am I playing Suro right now? I'm not 100% sure where I'm trying to start and go from. Like, what am I trying to join together here? Am I supposed to join up each symbol with another symbol? I could almost see that. Oh, does it come in here and shoot out here and come in here and shoot out here and stuff? It might be meant to go up to each tail. Maybe. Oh man, this is... 
Oh, a lot to process here. Are there any kind of clues around me here, or...? Oh! What is happening? So was that wrong? Okay, so yellow was middle, green was left. Is blue right, then? Oh, and then red. Okay... So, blue, yellow, green, red. That gives me something to go with. Also, I feel like I can see a certain inspiration for a certain castle in another game where if I said anything more, it'd be kind of a spoiler, but you know what I'm talking about, probably, if you, if you have any connection to that issue. Um, which side do I want to attach it to is the problem. Let's go from here to here, then here to... Th wow, I actually already have it set up that way. Then from here to... The red somehow. That might be harder. That goes to red, but can I make the blue from here to there? Not really working for me here. This could change though, right? So, blue to yellow, yellow to green, green to blah. Red. Yellow to green. This one's not used anywhere else. So can I change it to be more useful? This one can't be rotated at all. How do I make you reach red? Well, this isn't used for anything else, so maybe I can make you face something else. Nope, it's useless. The tail of green only attaches here. Which means it has to go down here. Which means it has to go through here. And that makes this messy. That means it basically has to loop through here. Green to red. So then there must be something else I can do to make the yellow work. We can't make the blue go this way because this that you can't rotate this one. It always goes the same. It's always the same. But I can't make this vertically go up because then this doesn't link up, does it? Well, that works there. But that won't. Unless I rotate it the other way around. No. It's symmetrical, so this will always tilt down in either a configuration. There's a lot of visual data process here. The question is, am I even right so far? about how I think this works. Let's link up blue to yellow. I'm gonna link up blue to yellow like this. Wait. Oh, it doesn't make sense. Cause I'm going mouth to tail to mouth to tail. So I should be starting at blue's tail. So my starting point doesn't even make sense to begin with. Let's change that. 
So tail to mouth, tail to mouth, tail to mouth. There we go. Try pressing blue. Well, golly gee, I guess I was right. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, am I gonna be inside? Oh my god, I guess I was really right. Jesus, man. <laughs> that is such a cool execution of an idea, but also I would be screaming the entire time. That is horrifying. That Just being in that machine and just being like, I hope I don't die horribly today. Especially, also that part with the revolver stuff going on. Uh, revolver is the most fitting thing to call it, I think. That, that's gotta be so painful. How much? What's the? Where are the shock absorbers and like in this chair I'm in? Cause like, holy crap, that uh, that bouncy ass weird revolver thing is like that's got to be so painful on like your spine. I probably pull a lever or something to get down, don't I? Okay, so I did it, and yeah, I'm definitely getting flashbacks to that castle. That's. It's interesting to see the very clear inspirations that game had. From this one, I mean, in that location in the, in the game, there even was straight up like a, there was a straight up mist uh, Easter egg in it, just in case I wasn't clear. How do I leave? I don't know how to get down. So I clicked. Okay, I, that's what that's what it was. I had to right click because the game won't let me look in that angle. I have, you have to right click to free the mouse. That was weird. Okay. Two down. It's nice being back in this peaceful beach island location, honestly. It's a nice break from, uh, the other more dangerous-looking worlds. This place is pretty chill. My sons. Nope, but that's just that message. Am I putting these somewhere, like here? Ah. Uh -huh. Uh, 
Wait, is this like a slide projector? Not so easy, is it, Atris? Running like a rat through a maze, looking for some sign that'll help you save your world. Is it over here? Is it over there? Is it someplace I can't find? Cirrus and Akinar didn't care about saving Narayan. All that talk about fixing instabilities, rewriting the age so that we would be free to live our lives, that was just talk to hide the truth of why they had come. But we believed their lies, Atris. So we abandoned our traditions, forgetting that those traditions were keeping Narayan alive. And when the last tree started to die, I followed them here to tell them what they had done. And they laughed. They said they would never fix Narayan. They said that they had already taken everything it had worth saving. So my dear old friend, Atris, I brought you to this place where your education begins. Find the remaining two symbols and then come see what your boys did to Narayan. what you expected, Atris, when you followed me here hoping to reclaim relation? This classroom, what you expected to find? I read your journal, you know, in Tamana, after I found your linking book abandoned outside this observatory. I read all about the Dunning, how you started their world again. Can you really do that, Atris? After everything that's happened to Narayan, could you start the world over again? I don't think so. I think there's too much blood on our hands, too many ghosts. Surely you can't change that with a pen stroke. One more symbol, Atris. Narayan is waiting. So I guess I missed temporarily that I was supposed to do that, but we're collecting three symbols and those three symbols can be put here for a message from our very displeased uh, antagonist who <laughs> is very mad at not me. <laughs> I don't think he I don't think he knows I exist, right? Could be wrong. I don't think that he knows that I exist as a human being. And so like I'm the victim. Not I'm not the only victim, obviously, but I am I am the most direct uh antagonist he's got in this scenario, and that I'm the person acti actually dealing with his puzzles and everything and his traps, and I'm not even the person he's mad at, which is really an interesting outcome for this all to have. Next one might be hard. I don't know. Uh, I kind of stumbled into both of the puzzles for the other ones, so I haven't. I never had to look for them. I found and solved the weird barrel bridge puzzle in the first episode right off the bat, uh, without even knowing what I, what the structure of the game was yet. And I solved and I saw these immediately. Didn't know what to do with them exactly, but I saw them immediately. I'm like, oh, I know what. I'm sure we'll solve that soon. And I could, and I correctly guessed that it was a redirection of light puzzle, so that was all straightforward. I kind of know where this one is, but that's about it. This will be interesting figuring out what the hell to do with you. There it is. <laughs> the bird one. How do I get to it? Good question. There's this strange thing. Lagoon water. 
What a weird perspective, too. You can, like, aim a plant, apparently. So solving how to get up there is gonna be interesting. Yeah. 